This was supposed to be 2.195. First shot. That was luck. I just scribed the line and eyeballed it. I made it within a thou. That's pretty cool. That doesn't ever happen to me. <laughs> anyway. So, um, this I didn't follow exactly on Tahasa's drawings. Mostly because I couldn't figure out what... I didn't calculate this properly. And whatever... I, I, however I messed that up, I'm not sure. But um, I don't think that really matters that much. I think I can just roll with it and make a slight modification and it shouldn't affect me much so this is kind of how we're looking on that part now so this is going to be like that and then as long as when i bore this i can make it line up with that i, I should be good to go and those three holes as well um which i was really worried about but i've got a digital readout and i think i should be able to figure that crap out if i ever want to become a machinist so um, I guess we'll see in the end what happens. Hoping I don't have to do this again. Yeah. Just took this thing off the machine and uh, this is I guess the moment of truth um, I don't know how you guys did this whether you made it out of a solid one inch piece or not but I didn't want to use that much thick material so I opted out and did this which this part took me like hours this piece that one didn't take me as long as this one um, I was having issues getting these bolt patterns uh, proper because and I'm probably jinxing myself because I haven't actually tested this yet but um, to get this hole here I was having a pretty good learning curve um, or pretty bad depending on how you're looking at it uh, it took me a while to get this hole perfectly here and these ones in this spot um, because that's how they need to be on here and yeah and I also didn't follow Haas's plans exactly on this um, but it's exactly the same height and everything. I changed this up just slightly. Um, I'm just concerned about this bore fitting. Um, right now it looks okay uh, by eyeball, but I've got a, these bearings are a tight fit. Um, I did bore this one and left a hair of wiggle room here. So for the first time, I'm gonna try to slide this on here and hopefully everything lines up. Um, this will be a pain in the ass if it doesn't. bad damn that's crazy it does line up and those holes uh, even the three holes line up so I messed up and did this right um, very surprised and I don't know if these are the proper bearings for this or not I just I know that they're the right diameter this bearing fits tighter than the other one does it's going on but there we go Okay, so, bam, there, this is, this part, I shouldn't say done, because I still need to mount that through there, um, but they line up, the bearings um, do, and yeah, surprising, I was worried about this. So this orientation-wise should go like that on the machine, uh, you see I have a, 
a reveal on each edge. Whoops, sorry, trying to get in the camera here. Uh, the reveal I have is a little bit on each side because this size block, I wasn't able to get to the exact size that I was hoping, which would have been three by three. I don't know what size Haas did, and I didn't see it on the drawing that I printed off, so I just did some guesstimates and uh, tried to run with it. So anyway, very satisfied with how this turned out so far. And yeah, thanks for watching.